So here's a cool way where you can make just this much last for quite a while and get the job done. So the first thing we got to do is cut this down to size. We could probably get two or three sweetest torches out of this. And now we just need to split it into quarters. Okay, so we got it split into quarters. Now we're gonna shave a little bit off on each quarter right here, just so that we have some spacing when we put this back together. Now we need a way to hold it together. Uh, I recommend that everybody keep a little bit of wire, some sort of wire in their pack with them at all times. So we're gonna use this wire to hold our Swedish torch together. Of course, you gotta have a fire kit in your pack, right? Get your fire going and let it catch real good. And it's a good idea too to put some sticks in to open the cracks up a little bit, give it some air. I forgot to tell you guys that. 